This is 3FM. Fundamentally, I, I want to make a difference to the Alamann. I believe it's necessary for the Alamann to move forward and make some progress, and it needs good people to step forward and actually make a contribution to that. On a national level, clearly the economy has to be uh, one of the key aspects, and uh, we need to both grow our revenue and control our costs. And uh, it's about the detail around how we develop the various different sectors that we've got, and also that we get a really good look under the skin of, of how government operates and where it spends its money and actually start to make some real common sense commercial decisions like you would make in the business world in which I've spent the last, the last 25 years and I think my, my background as a chartered accountant and having been brought up on the island makes me in a really good position to actually um, contribute to that. Government isn't a business but I think some of the principles around how that the, the money that the government spends is looked after needs a more business-like approach and I think it's a little bit commercially naive um, and that worries me. Um, but whilst the economy is clearly front of front of mind, we have to develop the economy without losing what makes the Alamance such a special place to be and I think there's a danger that with, with too much focus on the economy we could end up uh, making decisions that actually we come to live in regret and that actually take away our quality of life over here. It's a great place to live, the Alamance, great place for kids to grow up, for people to, to get elderly and we have to look after it um, and steward it so that we pass it on to the next generation in really good order. Tourism, I think the Alamance is a great product, um, but I don't think we're getting it across to the, 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 uh, the markets properly. I think it's, we've got to think of it as a niche product, which is really attractive, beautiful scenery, rural environment, uh, pretty accessible, um, to, to, to in particular to the major population centres, Manchester, London. Uh, we've, we've, we've got uh, sea and air links that do make it possible to come for sort of a uh, long weekend, whether it be for a sporting break or an activity. Um, I think we need to improve how we uh, relate to, to Ireland. I think the sea services to Ireland make it really difficult for the, the millions of people that are in Ireland to actually access the Alamann, and I think that's a big missed opportunity for us. I think the sea services um, clearly need to be resolved uh, as a matter of priority. I think it's in both the steam packet company's interest and the Alamann government's interest that those negotiations are brought to a a conclusion um, in, a, in, in a, a, a timely manner, but the Alamann government needs to recognise what a significant value that, that will create for the steam packet company and actually needs to make sure it gets a fair, a fair um, benefit from an, any, any contract extension. But I think if they don't get to a resolution quickly, the, the service will deteriorate and um, that will be harmful for, for everybody. Um, so, so my view is we need to approach it in a commercially astute manner and, and, and actually get something in place, take away the uncertainty, get a better service. We need, we need to have more boats than we've got at the moment and I think part of the issue of service in the Irish market is the fact that there physically isn't enough um, boats for, the, for, for that. Um, so very high priority subject to be, to be sorted out. Well, education is absolutely fundamental. It's, it, it provides a platform for people to... Um, to, to, to go on and, and, and as I did go from the Alamand to some of the best universities not just in the UK but but, but worldwide um, and we, we need to continue to invest in it uh, we need to make it relevant for, for everybody whether they're academic or whether it's vocational training we need to be training the, the, the future of the Alamand so whether that's engineers nurses um, professionals and we, and we need to be doing it in a way that actually is really appropriate for a modern 21st century economy. Um, I don't like the idea of, of, of young people coming out with big debts, as, as happens in the UK, and I think on the Alamann it's uh, more, it falls more on the families to, to, to uh, provide the funding, and I, th I actually think that's right. Um, I think when funding was, um, was cut, there was the topic of a graduate tax, and I think that may have been a better way to go forward. Um, whereby you pay it, pay it back, the benefits, in, in, in the future. Um, but we've got to make sure that young people are able to get the best education they possibly can, because that's the future of the Alamand. More music for the Isle of Man. 3FM.